Hi, I'm Kyle with Freezing Point, the makers of Frazzle. This video will go through how to install the Frazzle hologram mount and display. The Frazzle hologram mount and display is available for purchase by visiting our website at frazzle.myshopify.com. You may also talk to your distributor or Frazzle sales representative to discuss further. The kit comes in three parts, the mount, the hologram display or fan, and the hanging sign. There are six steps to the installation. For an easier installation experience, we recommend doing as much assembly on the ground or a table as possible. If there is enough countertop access to move the machine and access the back of the machine, it will make installation easier. Where there is limited countertop space or access, empty the product in the bowls before beginning installation. Even where there is enough countertop space, we still recommend removing the product from the machine. Step one, begin pull set assembly. Remove the two grub screws from the pull section A1 and A2 with an Allen wrench and connect pull sections A1, A2, and A3 by threading them together. Leave the base section A4 detached for now. Fasten the two previously removed grub screws with the Allen wrench. Step two, combine the clamp, clamp brace, and base section A4 of the pull. The clamp brace should be affixed to the two top holes of the clamp and the bottom two holes of the clamp brace to install the fan as high as possible. Attach the clamp and clamp brace using two 8x12 bolts. Tighten securely with an Allen wrench. Next, install the clamp brace with an Allen wrench to base section A4 of the pole using three 5x14 bolts. Step three, make a complete pole set. If there is enough countertop access to move the machine, Turn the machine and hang one back leg off the edge of the counter and unscrew the leg counterclockwise. Install the combined clamp, clamp brace, and base section A4 of the pole and replace the leg turning the leg clockwise. Once the leg is securely screwed in, slide the machine back onto the counter. If there's not enough countertop access to move the machine, the machine will need to be lowered from the counter or use a separate table before continuing. Using a grub screw, connect the assembled pull section A1 to A3 with the pull base section A4 to make a complete pull set. Step four, make the swivel arm assembly. For visual optimization of the display, consider placing the hanging sign behind the fan. Discuss first with the store owner or manager on duty. If there is natural light behind the machine, as in the case when the machine is in front of a window with direct sunlight, the hologram image may not display properly. In this situation, the hanging sign must be used or display moved elsewhere. Place the hanging sign between the visa plate and mounting bracket aligned with the holes. Securely attach the mounting bracket to the visa plate using the wrench and lock nuts provided. The mounting bracket should be affixed to the top two holes of the visa plate to install the fan as high as possible. Slide the visa plate onto the head of the swivel arm. Slightly angle the visa bracket downward, about five degrees for visual optimization of the hologram image when the hologram display is hung. Loosen and tighten the security nut with an Allen wrench until the desired tilt is achieved. Using a wrench, tighten the security nut to secure the visa bracket to the head of the swivel arm. Step five, fasten the swivel arm assembly to the completed pull set. Using a step ladder, fasten the swivel arm assembly to the top of the completed pull set by tightening the bolt with an Allen wrench. The pivot point of the extending arm should be behind the mounting pole to install the fan as far back as possible, while maintaining center alignment of the fan with the machine. The assembly should be as close to the top of the pole set to install the fan as high as possible. Attach the wire clips to the pole and swivel arm. There are two different kinds of clips. Two fit on the circular pole set and one on the rectangular swivel arm. The brackets will be used to hold the electric cord in place and out of sight as much as possible. For clips going onto the pull set, the part of the clip that will hold the cord should be placed on the back of the pull set, closer to where it will sit next to the wall. For the clip going onto the swivel arm, the part of the clip that will hold the cord should be placed at the bottom of the swivel arm. Step six, install the hologram display. Feed the cord through the wire clips. The fan's electric cord should be placed at the back of the mounting pole so it is less visible. The electric cord power adapter should rest in between the machine and the clamp brace. This way it is kept off the counter to avoid damage in the event of a spill or leak from the machine and to keep it out of the way for cleaning. Thread the power cord over the top of the visa plate and through the hanging sign on the swivel arm assembly. Plug the power into the back of the hologram display. Slide the hologram display onto the mounting bracket on the swivel arm assembly. 
Secure the hologram display by tightening the screw between the mounting bracket and hologram display using a screwdriver. For a single machine, the center point of the fan should be within half an inch of the center point of the two bowls. If a store has two machines, the center point of the fan should be directly in between the two machines. If the store has three machines, the fan should be centered between the two bowls on the machine in the middle. And if the store has four machines, the fan should be centered between the two inside machines. If the machine was lowered or moved from the counter for assembly, carefully replace the machine onto the counter. Plug the hologram display into a power source. You can turn the display on and off by plugging and unplugging the fan. Optionally, you can use the included remote. Once it is plugged in, the fan should immediately start spinning. Place the warning sticker visibly on the mounting pole. Adjust as needed for optimal look and safety. The fan should be as high and far back as possible to keep out of the reach of customers and children. If the fan is shaking excessively, ensure that the fan has been properly secured on the bracket and all parts are tightened down. The kit contains the necessary hardware to install the fan directly onto the wall if desired. If so, anchor the fan securely into the wall. Some key points to remember. Install the fan as high and far back as possible for optimal look and safety. The hologram mounting bracket and visa plate must be securely attached with the lock nuts provided. The warning sticker must be visibly placed on the mounting pole. Do as much assembly on the ground or table as possible. If you have limited countertop space, you may need to drain the machine to install the mount. Use a stepladder and extra table for fan installation ease. Slightly angle the fan downward for visual optimization of the image. If there is a window or natural light behind the machine, the hanging sign must be used or the fan image will not display properly. The fan's electric cord should be placed up the back of the mounting pole so it is less visible. The electric cord power adapter should rest in between the machine and the clamp brace. All parts and tools needed to assemble the kit come included. If there are missing or defective parts, you do not understand assembly instructions or have any concerns about the safety of the installation, please call the Frazzle service line at 1-877-372-9455. Improper installation may cause damage or serious injury. This product should not be used for any other purpose that is not explicitly specified in this instructional video. Thank you for your business and being part of the fastest growing frozen beverage company in the United States.